What is going on guys? My name is Richard Raidway back here with of course another Call of Duty Black Ops 3 video for you guys today. Today what we're going to be talking about is of course about the new Zombies trailer that was just released uh, before uh, earlier so I'll link it down in the description if you guys uh, missed it. If you, if you missed it you know just click the link down in the description it'll take you right to it. You guys can watch it and then watch this video but today we're going to be talking about Grod Grovi. Is, is that how you actually say that? was like my best accent guys. I'm, I'm really sorry. But anyway guys within this trailer there was a lot of secret and kind of hidden weapons and kind of DLC weapons that you might have missed that are actually in this map uh, DLC number three and I really wanted to point it out to you guys and maybe you missed it so I'm just gonna kind of clear it up for you guys and uh, just kind of show you all the weapons that was kind of hidden in this trailer so if you guys enjoyed today's video a like rating would be very very much appreciated let's see if we can break 200 likes that'd be absolutely amazing and with that being said let's jump right into the video so there was actually five kind of weapons that I did spot and that's I guess it's going to be like a little top five video uh, but there's five weapons that you might have missed that are actually in the trailer and we're going to be talking about it so of course the first weapon it's not really like a weapon per se but it's actually a specialist ability for the specter and as you guys know uh, the specter is one of his abilities is the ripper where he takes out the knife and you can lunge at people in multiplayer and you can basically kill people with a fast fast knife and uh, this is actually going to be in the new zombies map Grod Krovi so uh, basically uh, this is absolutely amazing we don't know how you actually get this specialist ability but I feel that this is going to be absolutely amazing the ripper in zombies would be very very vital because you can actually get out of tight situations where maybe you are cornered or maybe there's a lot of zombies and you can basically just lunge through all of them and kill them with this specter uh, the ripper kind of specialist ability in zombies So I think that's going to be very very vital you guys are probably going to want to look out for that because that's going to be important uh, For when you actually play this map So try to get this as fast as possible I think and you'll have a specter or the, the the ripper ability specialist ability in zombies You can get out of tight situations and it looks to be really awesome It's, it's not really like a knife per se, but it's almost like an energy kind of uh, Directed almost um, is a ripper or something like that. It's not really like a knife, but you can still lunge with it and it's definitely definitely awesome the next one in the trailer uh, you guys probably did see this and this was really cool to see and this was the dual wields nx shadow claws now as you guys know the nx shadow claw is a dlc weapon within multiplayer and it's basically like a crossbow and you can actually have the dual wield attachment within multiplayer and they are bringing it back within a uh, zombie so I'm, I'm pretty sure you can either uh you know buy this off the wall or odds are you will be getting this out of the random box within the zombies map so uh you will be getting this and once you see that you will be getting a kimbo nx shadow claws i think this is going to be very interesting to see how this plays out in a zombies game because we didn't see the nx shadow claws uh yet so this looks really awesome especially dual wield i cannot wait to play with these babies these things are absolutely amazing so guys there was a segment within this trailer and the person actually opened up the uh the random box and within this random box there was three specific weapons that i do want to talk about the first one being the ffar clear as day you guys can see the ffar as you guys know the ffar is within multiplayer it's a dlc weapon you get out of supply drops it's actually a re-imaged or redesigned kind of version of the famas within black ops 1 so that's going to be interesting the FFAR is an interesting weapon, and of course the FAMAS was, uh, is like honestly like a fan favorite gun, so that's why they brought it into multiplayer, but they are bringing it back into zombies. You can't actually get it within the random box in zombies, so this is going to be interesting to see how that plays out, but I wanted to mention that. The next one, oh my god, you guys are probably, probably hyped about this one. Uh, you may have you may have seen it, there was a lot of people talking about it, but within the random box kind of segment of the trailer, you can actually see the Ray Gun Mark III, or what we're saying it is going to be the Ray Gun Mark III. There's no official name for it, there's no confirmation that it is a Ray Gun, but clear as day, you can pretty much tell that is a ray gun and as you guys can see there's almost two of them you guys can see that there's two ray gun mark threes so it seems to be a ray gun that you could actually dual wield very very interesting i cannot wait to see how that plays out. i cannot wait to actually play with the ray guns and actually have them dual wield because imagine just running around the map the zombies map with dual wield ray guns that sounds crazy but that looks absolutely amazing and hopefully we get some more information about this ray gun soon uh within like a new trailer or something like that or when this dlc drops within a couple weeks time and as you guys know the last but certainly not least we actually got to see the PPSH. I did make a video about this earlier talking about the PPSH and now how it's returning to zombies, but I thought I would still mention it within this video because you guys might have missed it. I don't know how it'd be possible if you guys missed it, but I still wanted to mention it within this video because the PPSH, I'm so excited for that, man. It was a gun in World at War, a very popular SMG, and it's finally returning within zombies. And uh, earlier, a couple months ago, we actually found the coding within the PPSH in Black Ops 3, and we weren't sure if it's going to be real and if it was actually going to be coming into the game, and it finally is, so I cannot wait to get my hands on the PPSH within zombies and just shred zombies and just take over Garod Krovi. So that looks absolutely amazing. Uh, let me know if you guys are hyped for this zombies map. If you guys are, drop a like on today's video. If you guys enjoyed this kind of like top five like hidden weapons, maybe you missed it in the zombies map, but I really wanted to, you know, kind of point that out. So hopefully you guys did enjoy today's video. Make sure to drop a like and subscribe if you guys are brand new. And if you made this far into the video, make sure to comment Raygun in the comment section down below, and I'll see you guys on another one.